Sorry I can't join you this evening. Prior engagement came up in Berlin. How's business? It's early and we've just opened. I trust everything is on schedule. Of course. My documentation, Nicola. Adam? I thought about sending over Dieter and Brandt, but they were scared of taking them down. <laughs> Unbelievable. And how is your career as a torture officer for the high command going? They had to let me go, I'm afraid. Not everyone agreed to my methods, but I always get results. And as you see, some even decided it was in their best interest to work with me. My man and I have got a job to do. You'll find documentation allowing you access across the checkpoints of South America. There is also satellite grid reference points, military mission briefings and command appointment of the Wolfpack as soon as you dispose of their current leader, Captain Schnell. Understood. And what of my Wolfpack? Tell them whatever necessary to get the job done. It's your outfit now. Bring me back my prize and you and your men will be looked after, Commander. Please, both you and your Aryan Dawn fanatical group don't have the balls to carry out this mission. You'll be surprised at the size of my balls. Devon will see you taken care of. She is ex-Israeli Special Forces assassin. Has she been searched? Check her now. A video's in free line.
Yes. It's not just a game. It's a battle of wits between two opponents. The board's your battlefield, and the pieces are your army. Yeah, well, I'm the bishop, obviously. <coughs> oh, fuck off, you queen. It's a game of patience. Anticipating your enemy's next move and knowing when to sacrifice your troops until you gain the position needed to win the war. Look, boss, I'm sorry, but a bloke in the shop said this is the closest he had. Right, losers, let's see what you got. I'll take your beans and bacon, and I'll rage my lock knife. Eat my balls. Packaging, you two packaging. Bloody hell, you bunch of kids. Eee, just a snap of Right, pay attention. I've got the bi monthly newsletter here. It's the usual bullshit, but there's a pretty cryptic crossword on page three. I know you like that. Sweet. Right, I have, I have here the cards from the suggestion, suggestion box for this month. I will not be submitting these to Brigade. And I think you know for the why. Right, let's see. Naked Tuesdays. Yes. Lot <laughs> <laughs> uh, mm. <laughs> uh, dancing beer strippers. Oh, I Bob. don't even know what that is. Yeah. And it looks like it's written in shit. It's twiglets. Oh, aye, it is, aye. Thanks, Bob. Nice one. Uh, bring back Metal Mickey. Why? It'll never be as good as you remember it. To be fair, boss, they brought back Battlestar, and that was terrible. Uh, oh. Uh, this one's, uh, this one's by Anonymous. I suggest Bob stop snoring like a warthog before I stick my fist down his throat and pull out his lower intestines. That's, uh, that's a fair point, that, Bob. You do sound like a pig when you snore. Fair enough, boss. Yeah, oh, what's this? I suggest, in order to stop an awful, that, that should be an awful, I think, yes, you mean there, or an authorised stamper in note reading at suggestion cards prior to monthly meeting, we implement some sort of sensor warning device or locking mechanism, possibly a key. This could be mounted next to the suggestion box, in a box. Uh, this one's from Flash Gordon from Crapsville. With reference to the last suggestion, to stop people gaining entrance to the suggestion box using suggestion box key in the suggestion box key box, I suggest Major Cross swallows a key at the start of month, then regurgitates or poops out the key prior to the monthly briefing. Peter Young. Alternatively, we need a suggestion box key box key to secure the suggestion box key box. This could be kept in a box by the suggestion box and the suggestion box key box. Lost me. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> right, settle down, settle down. These are healthy safety cards or near miss cards. Brigade, they want us to fill this in whenever we see anything, any kind of issue to do with health and safety and near miss and all that bloody corporate buggering bollocks. Yeah, you got it, boss. Right, so I'll give you a couple of these out of each here. Right, it's very important, anything you see that could cause an accident or injury, fill them in and I'll get them sent off. And no pissing around this time, right? And when Miller and Kowalski, when they come back off their leave, I'll tell them the same. Jerry's are here. Oh, the Germans are here, the Jerry's are here. Oh, oi, Bishop, right, boy. Oh. Remember last year when Russians come? And you helped, yeah, don't, yeah, oh, you can laugh now, son, you can laugh now. And you instigated that bloody drinking game and three of them got hospitalised and had to get bloody winched off in chopper. Yeah. None of that this time. None of that. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Gentlemen, welcome to <laughs> welcome to Eagle's Nest. That was my line, Bishop. Fucking hell. Welcome to Eagle's Nest. Come on in. Dial the meds across. Come on in. Hello. Hello. Wave hello, lads. This is the wolf pack. Oh, cool. The wolf pack. So do all of you have, like, a canine-related sort of call sign nickname? You know, like Hyena and Doberman, you know. But where, where, where the birds are prey, I, I'm Condor. No. We don't have stupid nicknames related to dogs. I'm Raven. This is Eagle, our leader. Hello. We are the wolf pack. That is our call sign. Owl. 
Oh, fucking him, bitch. They're not doing that. Oh, well, that sucks. I'm an owl. Woo! Right, come on. Move in. Come in and drop your kit off here and come to the briefing area. We'll tell you what's going on over the next few days for your jungle training package. Right, take a seat, guys. That German all there got tits. And he's right. Hey, love, over here. Men, my name is Major Legion Cross, and this is my team of instructors Corporal Bishop, Lance Corporal Boxer, and Bob. Hiya. <coughs> Over the next four days, we aim to teach you the basics of jungle survival. You, what can you tell me about the jungle? The jungle is massive. Oh, I, asked, I guess it is. I suppose the jungle can be massive. It could be a scary place to the untrained chap. We plan to change that. You will learn how to fight, adapt and survive in hostile jungle conditions. We will teach you to hunt, track and trap individual beasts. Wildlife and berries, which are safe to eat, you will be eating for never that. And you also learn what water holes, if any, to drink from. You will learn unarmed combat from Corporal Bishop and from Boxer. And, and Bob will be there too. Fuck yeah. Field craft skills, fighting and manoeuvrement in built up conditions, especially at night in zero visibility, and acclimatise you to the heat, the sounds, and the creatures of the jungle. I can see some of you, you're a bit unconvinced. Who's this old codger telling me how to be a soldier? Where does that mofo get off, dude? Gentlemen, I've spent the last 20 years in every yellow hole you can imagine. Borneo, Belize, Bradford, Africa, Laos, Rhodesia, San Serif, Crimea, I, I was just down by the river there, Crimea River. Boss, nobody? <laughs> I told you that one first. You will learn fighting skills used against the Japanese army in Malaysia and Burma. Close quarter tactics designed by the Chindits and Gurkhas over 50 years ago. These techniques brought us victory in WW2 against them sausage eating on and all their mother nutters. I hope you realise I told my man from German descent. Go on, that's good. You'll know what exactly what I mean then. This is not 1944, Major. My men are trained to kill and we can kill Russians. Oh, well, no offence taken, lad, no offence taken. I tell you what. A couple of years ago, I was working as a survival, survival, uh, survival guy for the BBC. And I saved my good friend David and Attenborough's life from wrestling the Kimono Dragon into submission. Do they teach you that in Berlin? No, oh, do they buggery? Eh? Biggest killer in the jungle. Anybody? Is it malaria? Good, good. But no. Uh, someone else? Zippo. Try again. The monkeys. Monkeys? Fuck off. No, biggest killer in the jungle, Deadfall. It'll squash you like a pancake. Watch in for a complete demonstration. <laughs> oh, keep the noise down! As with all my jungle survival schools, there will be no weapons or live fire on set on the, uh, this area. But I do expect you to treat it as a tactical training exercise where possible. In a minute, I will be handing you over to my instructors for this evening's events. This evening, you will prepare your defensive positions. Post sentries. Hey, who goes there? Not now. Not now. And prepare your evening meals. What you got there, soldier? Meet me, Moussaka, with mung beans. You disgust me. Any questions? Good. Questions lead to answers. Question everything and get your answers and truly you will learn. Instructors, take over. You and the major lads, keep stuff together. Lots of work to do, work to do for bedtime. Get some kit, lads. Good Right, you heard the major ladies. Lots of work. Someone needs negligible. That's alright. Old, incompetent. Okay. Needs to watch. Needs to go.
fucking slimmer suit, who brought that? Yeah, uh, this is putting me on a diet again. Again? Right, I've read this one before. Could do a good film to watch right about now. Point Break or Commando? Oh, I love that film. The one with Keanu Reeves and, uh, oh, what's it called? Nick Nolte. Nick Nolte? Nick Nolte's not in it. Uh, yeah, he is. He plays um, Johnny Utah's FBI partner. That's Gary Busey, you bellend. Nick Nolte. Who the fuck's Gary Busey? Gary fucking Busey. He was in Under Siege, Surviving the Game, and Predator 2. Oh, Predator 2. No, I've never seen it. You've never seen Predator 2. Everybody's seen Predator 2. Predator 2? Never even seen the first one. What the fuck? Are you too serious? Aye, fuck aye, you bastards. You okay there, boss? I, I, I'm alright, don't worry about me. I'm just going to go check on troops, see how the Germans are getting on there. I think it's still definitely Nick Nolte. Hey, up. What you got there, son? It's me iPhone. Phone? No, 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 no. We gave orders this weekend, no phones. How does it even bloody work? Do you have to blink or something to get it to work? What? No, it's the letter I. Oh, the letter I. So what do we do then? You can peg. Uh, look at the two. You can wait. Uh, li listen to the music. You can even browse. And go to the Apple store. Apple store? No, just get them off the trees, mate. Uh, not not that trees. Not, not that kind of apple. It's, it's the, the company. company! And you, have you got one of these bloody apple phones? Oh, no. I've got a blackberry. So, what do you think about when you're taking a piss box up? Uh, uh, I'll think about my family back home, I guess. Um, you know, taking the kid to the park and that. He's nearly six now. Shut up, you gay. That's not what I mean. Me, <laughs> it's modern day, and I've been approved to put together my own magnificent seven. There's me. And you, the major, obviously, stacks, and three others. And we're taking a whole army of Mexican banditos. <laughs> oh, I'm with you, mate. I keep on having this precarious one about a zombie apocalypse. And it's, uh, well, all I've got really is a jetpack and a lightsaber. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably some kind of samurai armor and stuff as well. Me? A bottle of Rehypnol inside the Playboy Mansion. Starkers. <laughs> so does Bob make you magnificent, oh, silly man. Fuck he does. <laughs> silly young fuck. <laughs> oh, that's Major Cross's brother-in-law and best bud just slagging off her, mate. Probably the only remaining family that he's got. You should hear what the Major's one is. He told me last month, mentally it was, Something about being inside some sort of mechanical exoskeleton cockpit with missiles or some shit. Oh, keep it to yourself, mate. <laughs> I put in for a Paulson for front line. Major Bud's outfit. Oh, need some action, man. No offence, but if I stay here any longer, I'll just end up as crazy as the Major. Oh, oh wait for me, mate. Wash your hands, you dirty shit. Yeah, yeah. Like you did. <laughs> Major, my men would like to challenge our men to a game of football. Football, eh? That's that one with the uh, little round ball and them big poles, isn't it? Right, you're on, son. What's that? I'll get changed. I don't know when you know what. Yeah, boss. Oh. 
So what you're saying, Bishop, is if we let these Germans beat us, let us beat us at our own game, just because you want to be here, that's your idea, is it? Huh? Have you got a better one? Is that your idea? Is that, is that what you're saying yeah. to me, you your officer? Idea? Yeah. Well done. Well done, lad. Well done. Good time. Good time. Come on, get the beer, Bloody old boxer, what are you doing? Get inside, you idiot. Sorry, boss. Bloody young Look what I found with one of the Nazis. I think it's some sort of time travel device. You know what? You're talking bloody rubbish, son. Look at it. That gives me an idea. Come on. Come with me. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that was mental. Right. Oh. If this is what I think it is, be prepared. Be prepared, Bishop. Right. Follow me. Come on. Congratulations, Frau Hitler. It's a boy. I will call him Adolf. Oi, Doc. Too. We need to work. Uh, what do we need to do? We need to take the food field craft, uh, booby traps, but we'll do that Wednesday. Alright, uh, 
range running through uh, close quarter combat, close quarter combat. A bit of that business. Uh, yeah. Sound good to you? Yeah, awesome. We'll get you on bother on that. Yep. Aye. I think Boxer's got the lads out on that patrol at the moment. Yeah, making sure uh, friends are secure. Aye. Bit unprofessional, but we'll get, we'll get him there. Yep. Before after two world wars, they would learn a thing or two. Aye, I know. Do you remember them Chinese we had that time? Or was it before the Russians, weren't it? Yes. About whatever happened to them, I can't even remember them leaving. Look, Major Cross can't find out about his spot. As far as he knows, them Chinese they left. Yeah. I can't know that it's just the jungle and should kill them all. Who plays his heart? What is alcohol poisoning anyway? It's alright, son. I'll teach you when you're older. Oh, it just disappeared. Right? That's a bloody strange one, that, I told you. Germans will be on the ration packs tonight anyway. First night, see how they get on. You are right there, Bob? Doing a good job, son. Your mum will be proud of you. I've seen it all. I've seen it all. Morning, ladies. Let's go. Get up. Fall in ten minutes. Come on. Hard spoon. 
Hey, come on, out, let's go, move. Get your kit squared away, go to school face. Good morning. <laughs> morning, Kessler. Hope you slept all right. Make sure you check them boots for wee beasties. The jungle, remember? Swine hunt. Quiet. We'll look at some digging in our case rooms. Hmm? Hey up! What are you listening to there, son? Is that that uh, Justin Bieber lake or uh, Merlin's penis? Merlin's penis? Miss Merlin's cock? Oh no, 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 not Merlin's penis. Gandalf's cock. Gandalf's cock. What? One direction. One direction, that's him. One direction. That's fucking hell. I knew I was. I'm all right. I'm all right. Oh. It's all right. I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> Master is my ass. You there, soldier, come here and smell me. Have a sniff. What do I smell of? Yeah, sort of a nasty woody smell, sir. Go, Wubbership, sniff that man. Well, let's toss up between peppermint toothpaste, lavender facial wipes and ocean body spray. And in conclusion, Corporal. It smells like a man or boss. That's right, you smell like a newer. I smell like a tree, and you smell like an oar. Granted, if you were bopping with your mates down at the discotheque, it would probably be better to smell like a prostitute than an orc tree. But the only thing getting laid around here is... Bishop, help me out. Chicken eggs. Eggs? Oh, yeah, my eggs are getting cold. Come on, Bishop. I suggest you go and smell your men, Sergeant. Smells like a bloody brothel. How long is this Chirad going on for? Not long now. Find me my location. I've identified four possible locations, Colonel. Excellent work. You know the drill. Carry on. working together as a team to get from one piece of cover to the next while under enemy fire. Tomorrow we'll be doing such things as close quarter battles in the uh, dense parts of the jungle there, uh, booby traps, and we'll do a session on edible wildlife, fungi, etc. that you can find inside. Uh, what we're going to do now is me and Bob's going to show you <coughs> what to do for pairs for our manoeuvre. Me and Bob are going to give you a quick demonstration now. As you see, Bob's down in cover now, so he can pop up and give me covering fire, so I can be ready to move. You always, at all times, need to be speaking to your partner, telling them what you're doing. So if you get stuck, like you get a stoppage on your weapon, or you get an empty magazine and you can change over, make sure you tell your partner so they can keep on giving covering fire, then obviously you've always got something going down the way to stop the enemy. Right, so Bob's going to pop up now, simulate some fire for me. So I can move. Move then! Okay, as you can see, I'm now in cover. I can shout to Bob, so Bob can move up and I can give him cover and fire. Bob, move! Right, there you go. Bob's got a magazine. 
magazine chain, so I need to carry on fire until he's sorted that. Right, lads, it's not too hard. Obviously, we've got no weapons at the moment because we're doing it dry to get it, stay safe, keep it practice. Anybody got any questions? No, right, who's next? We need the first pair of volunteers. Okay, troops, I'm Lance Corporal Boxer, and today I'm going to take you through tracking. Follow me. Right. Sid Little, what can you tell me about field craft? Making little animals. Making little animals? That's hobby craft. You're getting totally mistaken there. Chuckle Field craft, jungle survival, anything? What have you learned so far from Bishop and Bob? Live fire. Live fire. We're not doing live firing. Uh, Boxer's going to be running you through some tracking later on. That should be fun for you anyway. Uh, you, school space, family, my boys, and your pink dressing gown. Have you got anything to say, Dr. Phil? Didn't think so. Oh, hello, Bob. Dinner's ready. Dinner's ready! Come on, lad, dinner's ready! Come on! Chicken, I think, is in it. Depends what Boxer's managed to track. Tolan. Mind if I can walk through sheets or gather, you know, put a feet in, take it easy. It's hard work. Fritz! Had dinner on the go, what? What? Don't think you can understand you, mate. Let's see if I'm wondering if I can understand you. Two wars. Mm. Two wars. Show themselves to be a bit better this time. I don't know what I could do right now. What? Some Harry Bones. Which sort then? No, same. <laughs> it's got to be the uh, the sports mix. Sports, sports mix. mix. Oh. What's what's the ones with the uh, the jelly babies and jelly beans in it? Oh, super mix. That's the ones. <laughs> and them little eggs. Mm. I don't like the uh, yolks. Star though. mix. Star mix. I don't like the eggs. Why do I, like I don't know. I eat the yolk and I chuck the white. <laughs> That's a bit random. Oi! Mindle! Get up your lazy ass and do some work. So unprofessional. Lee, you wanted to see me, Major? Oh, afternoon, Kessler. Come in, take your seat. Can I offer you a drink? Give him a kaplunk. I'm more of a chess player. Do you have a chess board? Cheese board? Oh, chess board. No, I can offer you hungry, hungry of those. Or uh, buckaroo, I think we've got somewhere. But I think we've lost most of the little pieces. Sure you're all okay for a tipple? Have you read the book, The Art of War by Sun Tzu? Don't say I have Sun Tzu, no. Have you read uh, Spike Milligan's Hitler and my part in his dang ball? Can't say I have. I must go on my men are waiting. Right, I'll get to the point, Commander. There's a couple of things been bothering me. Firstly, I've noticed your troops digging all over the North Training Sector. Fire trenches, Major. Part of the jungle training. Fuck off, Kessler, that's bullcrap. 
I've heard alarming reports of choppers flying a landing, and Bob has seen troop movements at the beachhead. We got the men. I, I simply can't account for these numbers and what they're doing here. This was definitely not in my orders from brigade, and uh, apparently they're they're armed. This is not part of the training package. Let me tell you. I've also I've also heard some upsetting rumours from base. There's been a nightclub destroyed in the UK, right? <laughs> Apparently 30 people killed, including the daughter of the German foreign minister. <laughs> Apparently this club was a front for the British chapter of the Aryan Dawn. There's been a spotted plane, ah, that's been seen, circling our area yesterday. And of course that mysterious disappearance of your predecessor, Captain Schnell. I find this all very alarming, Colonel, and I've placed men on standby bracket brigade. Let me tell you a story, Major. My grandfather was a proved colonel in chief of Hitler's staff. Shortly after Operation Valkyrie to personally hold the safety of the Fuhrer. After the Eagle's Nest fell, he arranged for the executions of most of her Hitler's staff and his double in the bunker. And Frank Berlin had captured the Allied aircraft troops to South America. Poppycock, I heard it were Argentina. They only stopped there for some corned beef. Oh. I can assure you this, it is a truth class. My grandfather made detailed notes. Nicola and her alien friends have contacts in high places. And then they discovered the aircraft were filled with liberated priceless artifacts that funded my little trip here and gave me the necessary clearance to cover the Operation Mastermind. Nazi gold, eh? Yeah. This is just a bloody glorified treasure hunt, isn't it? It's only a matter of time before I do what I want. Especially now I'm in charge over here. Unfortunately, Nicola and Captain Schnell, your mercenary scum, won't be around to see my triumph. Checkmate, Major. Hands up, Fritz. Fuckaroo. I've heard enough of this. Well, speak English. Oh, bastard. Sorry, boss. Court's napping. So what are they? Neo-Nazis or something? No, I think they're just plain old Nazis. They're not robot Nazis, ghost Nazis, space Nazis, or zombie Nazis. No, I don't think so, Bob. Oh, okay. Oh, oh. Are they time travelling Nazis? Because that would be cool. Right, guys, you get called too. Exactly. Right, Bob. I'm fine. Get that shot for down. The rule, Colonel. Bring up Jack and Patrol. What are you doing? I told you so, Bob. Bring in the reinforcements. It's time for action. His nerves were weakened. Yeah. By the colonel. I thought he had sex with farm animals. What's wrong with that? Leg it, boss. We got you covered. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my. Oh. 
so right. not worth it. Right, right. We'll get a bit of warning next time and I've helped. for the lost ark of the covenant the indiana jones found it years ago mate any ideas mate off the top of my head boxer we dig three tunnels directly underneath the goon towers and 50 feet short of the line, and dispose of the tunnel soil from my trouser pockets well, let's be a dick about it hey mr sweet talker you gonna talk me this way Foxes everywhere. Hey, it'll be dark soon. That's when the fun will begin. Whittle down some of these idiots. <laughs> yeah, I'm wondering, do you reckon it'd be a massive hassle if I get one of these guys' attention, see if I can get escorted to the bog? Or shall I just piss myself out? <laughs> <laughs>
can see you, wizard. You're not impressing me. You're not bugging and impressing anybody. <laughs> Go away, wizard. Go away. Go away, wizard. <laughs> you must do is help me track down the Major. He's killing my troops and he is upsetting my plans. Kessler is out there now. The Colonel is not happy. He has lost men. He's behind schedule and he needs to find his prize. Will you help me track down your Major? Your mad Major? Never. If you don't, I will start the Boxer. And then Bob, and then you, piece by piece. You will all die before I give them up and give up the Major. Well, we will see. This mad Major is killing my men. The Colonel is not happy. He's out there now searching for him with my squad. I've had to bring in reinforcements. I will start with Boxer. I will kill him slowly, and then Bob. Then that leaves you. So... You help me track him down, or I kill you all. Your choice, Bishop. Fuck you. Fuck me? No, fuck you! I need to find my prize. I have orders to follow. My colonel has given me strict instructions, and I will follow them to the letter. He's instructed me to make sure that you Fighting with me. Yeah, all right then. Good, good. Dieter, take a man, get out there, and find this fucking major. Yeah. Kill this madman. Go. Rouse. What? Move England out. Self, Major. But Kessler, he wants that honor himself. I need to find the box and get out. Down this jungle. <laughs> No way, all these years, bugging me, just bugging me. You're mad! You're mad! You're mad! I'm not mad! You're not real, you're just in the end. Ever since my wife and kids died, I just need a drink. I just need a drink, and I'll be fine. How much do you get paid? Euros, yeah. dollars, pounds. Euros. 
Shut up. Where's the major? Thank you, Bishop. Why have you let us out into a field? Ah, I see. You and I now, Bishop. Come on. Have you got the sign? Why, Bishop? You got somewhere to be? No, don't be enough, I just want to know. Well, it's, uh... <laughs> Germany won, England won. We may not have won the football, but we've won the war. Actually... Hmm, donkey shite. Fritz, oh. how's about a fag for a condemned man? Go on, eh? Do not let the English escape. Bring up Jackal Squadron. Back up Tesla and find me that box. I will deal with the Englanders myself. Ralph? Ralph? Hold on. Me, poppy little terror. He nearly sawed his head off. He shoots him again, and he's done in. What's wrong with ya? Come on. Any words later, like you and me? Hurt! Hurt! I think we found it. The box. The box. Tesla, Tesla, do you think we found it? It's the box. You may want to come and have a look at this. 
Excellent. Love it about the chopper are very, very, very soon. Let's get it open. See what's inside of it. Nice! My God! It's buffering. We need to get to the nest to make a defensive stand. Lethal weapon. He played Mr. Joshua in Lethal Weapon. Oh, Gary Busey. Oh, no, you mean now? Let Let's get Harry. Yeah. Oh, brilliant film, but no, no, it he, he wasn't in Point Break. Point break, Gary Busey. I fucking told you, boxer. No one likes a smart ass bishop. Yeah, have, have a look for a film. Um, oh no, it's a, it's a, it's a bunch of terrorists. We're planting bombs on the Eiffel Tower. I think they, oh, I think they escaped using like zip wires or something like that. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's definitely not Superman the movie, but um, I think it's got Britt Eklund's in it. I saw it a few years ago. Right. You're not going to get all psychotic if I can't find it or it's not available on DVD like when you eventually track down the humanoid with James, James Bond's jaws, are you? Ah, oh, that was my favourite kind of film as a kid. That that was the film Star Wars could have been. It's called Hostage Tower. Uh, Peter Fonda. Douglas Fairbanks Jr. Don't release them DVD. Motherfuckers.
back between me. Get back. Move! Go, go, go. Water bridge, water bridge, water bridge. Cover me, tell me where to go. Keep me covered! Right, get across the bridge, so I've got you covered. No! Get in there, get in there! Which one is it? Is it three o'clock, one o'clock, or three, four fucking clock? Three at one o'clock. Three Germans at one o'clock. You got it? Got it. 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 Got
Take a fag break or something. That's a keg you owe me for one that, you knobhead. A keg. A keg? Piss off, I'll get you a crate. And I, how am I supposed to get a keg into the jungle anyway? And how, how are we going to cool it? That's 80 pints. Highly unrealistic. Okay, a crate. But I want premium beer. Not that supermarket cheap piss water. Uh, go, go on about your drama queen. Jesus. I said I'm sorry. Don't affect, forget a crate. In fact, write it down. I want written evidence. And I'm writing a yellow card. Definite health and safety incident in that. Right, restart the war. Crate of beer, the least you could do for blowing nearly blowing my bloody head off. Still banging on about that is miles away, complete exaggeration. What about whiskey? No, nah, whiskey gives me a banging headache. What about peach snaps? Peach snaps, that's well gay. But what about when you nearly blew me up and went to Panama? You don't see me banging on about that all the time, do you? I've never been to Panama. Well, who was that then? How would I know? It's you and me, the dead Kessler. I want you, and I am going to kill you. Where are they? Oh, hang on. What? Don't you? Answer it then, it might be important. Hello? Boxer? Yeah. Have you had an accident in the past three years it wasn't your fault? Come on, fuck off! Get on the net, get Tesla and find the Major. Find the mercenaries. Get me a drive. Hey, do you know they remade the Karate Kid? What? Yeah. Uh, Jackie Chan teaches Will Smith's kids Kung Fu. So it's a Kung Fu kid? No, still Karate Kid.
one, mate. Move him out. Look at him. He's got four o'clock. That's why he's going down. He's going down. I'm now moving over to the left. I'm going to press the front down. Just hope he's on his way to get over there before I hit him. Boss! It's Boxer. Where are you going? Boxer. I'm going to go and take down Kessler. If I can get the chief, the rest of them buggers should revert back to their own themselves. Well, sir, they're not vampires, they're Nazis. Aye, 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 I know that. I had to go in there, Boxer. Go <laughs> <laughs> on, go on. Don't need these, then. You sneaky German bastard. No escape now, Major. We're going to die, Major Cross. <laughs> That's not gold. You are going to die, Major Cross. You're going to die. You are. Do you remember the, the first thing I taught you back at briefing, Kessler? Eh? Remember the first lesson I gave you? Always watch out for deadfall. That's fucking Hitler. Hitler? Can't be. Let me tell you a story, Major. My grandfather was a proved <laughs> chief of Hitler's staff. Shortly after Operation Valkyrie, to personally uphold the safety of the Fuhrer. Yeah. Sure Here, check his balls. He's only supposed to have one. <laughs> Fuck that, you can Get check that. Get in there. No. Oh. No, there's nothing there. Here, check this out. <laughs> hey, Bishop! <laughs> I'm the Fuhrer! <laughs> Not so impressive now anymore, are you, buddy? Oh, How much God. do you reckon we could get for him on eBay? About 20 quid. Is that it? Kessler's dead. It's time we got the bloody hell out of here, lads. Hey, boss. Look what's in this box. What's this? <laughs> so it's Hitler. Gold. Bloody Hitler. I thought it was meant to be gold. Boss. Found this in the office. I think Sergeant Brandt left it there. Looks like some kind of improvised explosive device to me, son. Give it to Bishop. He'll make sure he gets back to its rightful owner. I'm good like that. Whoa there, stop firing! It's not gold, it's in the bones! Oh, 
little bit left. Rest in hell. Why didn't he just have to go first there? Come on, boys, let's get the bugger and aloe out of here. Yeah. This way, come on, come on. Not me, I'm still with you, buddy, mate. We were a good home. We were our home. Poor Bob. Come on, lads. I'll buy you a pint. Do one right now. Yeah. Okay, one of the way, one of the way. It's all the best. One of the best. It's all the best. Out. That's him, One Direction. Alright, we're in there. He's in there for thinking. I'm alright, I'm alright. <laughs>
gentlemen. Welcome. To... <laughs> Welcome to Eagle's Nest. That was my line, Bishop. You know. Welcome to Eagle's Nest. Did you even go to the Apple Store? The Apple Store? Just get him off the trees, mate. No, no, not that kind of apple. It's the yeah, company. <laughs> no, 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 that wasn't. Look at pictures, text, tweet. You can go to the Apple Store. Apple Store? Get him off the trees, mate. No, no, not that kind of apple. It's that is the wrong fucking oh, accent. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> <now. That> was... <laughs> well, I was ready to go for it. Oh, Rolling. If you want, you can... We could get Kieran to move around. Just I think we put him off the second I yeah, said, I think we got him off. But we got that. Rolling. Rolling. Colonel, your lip is swollen. Oh, Bicu. By a wasp. Wasp? Wasp don't have teeth. The ones in Germany do. Very big, sharp teeth. Wasps. <laughs> Did you stop them? Your English wasps. Your English wasps. They don't have teeth. They have no fight. They have a little sting. Question everything and truly you will learn. Right. Man down, man down. Merlin's cock? No, not Merlin's cock. Uh, Gandalf's penis. Gandalf's penis. What? Congratulations, Mrs. Mrs. Hitler. Hitler, yeah. Yeah, Mrs. Hitler. Hitler. Yeah, we can do it again. Oh, the tube's on fire. Put that away, or chop your arm off. Sorry, we did that again. The door was heavy. 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 It's a face you have a really strong forearm muscle as well. Uh, go to the... Go to the desk. See if you pay in. Like grid references points. Let's do that again. Yeah. Sorry. This is hard. I know. It is, isn't it? Okay. Has she been searched? Check her now. Are you filming upstairs? <sighs> yes. And it doesn't matter that I'm looking down. You can, Matthew, you can say whatever you want. No, you know, right. young director. As soon as you dispose of their current leader, Dr. Schnell. Dr. Schnell. Dr. Sh where did you get Dr. <laughs> Schnell from? <laughs> Let's go. Oh, what? no way! Right, we'll carry on. Is there, does it matter how many takes you do? No, it doesn't no. matter. Okay, until it's perfect. Has she been searched? Check her now! No, that's really gay. Let's do that again. <laughs> that was getting a bit better! Yeah, it was good. You can't... You need, you need to be more critical, like of what I'm doing, Matthew. It was You're good. director. No, you need to say, shit, do it better. Go on. I wasn't ready. I picked all that four that. times. Pick them up. Look tough. Don't laugh. Please don't laugh. Oh my god! I'm not that really funny there. You said four times. Are you? See that? That was good, but everyone, but you were laughing. Oh, Fuck sake, Kevin. One more time. Don't laugh. So we need that without the laughter. I'm behind there. Fuck's sake. <laughs> Again? 
Ja. Okay. <laughs> Don't laugh at me. You want to concentrate on me? Concentrate on him. He's the director. I'm just second. Well, this one, anyway. I'm just texting. <laughs> what do you want from you me? You know, it looks a bit like... Uh, he looks a bit like an older, wizened Wolverine with that hair. <laughs> Do you not think? Konnichiwa. <laughs> That's a bit harsh. Uh -huh. Racial slur off a child. <laughs> oh, slap you. Bob's getting the above the stage. Oh, no, yeah. Do you think he is? Yeah. Sword a throat or two. Do you think you are? Dude. 12 hours on set. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm skewed, mate. You know they're right. He has only got one ball. There we go. How are you doing, guys? All right. It's uh, day three of the shoot, isn't it? Is it day three? Yeah, it is day three. Yeah. yeah, we've got one day left tomorrow. Yeah, Mike's guide. He's been, he's been brilliant. Uh, yeah. Leyland Paintball Centre, VR 2660 N. Yeah. Uh, Mitchell Lane, brilliant yeah. place. The, the guide's been awesome. Well, you're Very accommodating. You're, you're pretty. Got baby Hitler there. Yeah. You want to pan down and see baby Hitler? We have. Naked baby. We've blown up a helicopter today. We've blown up a body. A body. We did a bazooka scene, which turned out absolutely brilliant. Yeah, awesome. That was an accident, though. Are you doing your shout out? Shout out to the bazooka maker. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Yeah.